Okay, we're here today with Kenneth Juhas of Auteur Wines. Hello, Kenneth. Hello there. I want to hear a little bit about what you do. I, you're the owner, you're the winemaker, you have a big hand in everything that's done. Absolutely. So t tell me about your love for this. We are, uh, we're a small brand. We are a boutique winery uh, producing less than a thousand cases a year, making only Pinot Noir and Chardonnay from uh, very small microclimates and the coolest in the area. We source fruit from Oregon and also from California. Uh, so we're sourcing from vineyards like Highland um, and Shea Vineyards in the Willamette Valley of Oregon, and then also Sonoma Coast, Sonoma Stage, and uh, we're also starting to get into the Monterey area as well. So basically just uh, very cool microclimate sites, small production vineyard, vineyard designated Pinot Noirs. And what are some of the characteristics of your Pinots? What kind of flavors do people get out of them? Uh, well, my, my goal is to make Burgundian style or French style Pinot Noirs, but remembering my place. I don't want to force a wine to go in any direction that it doesn't want to go to. I always remember, want to remember its place. But what I like about Pinot is its elegance and its beauty. And my wife and I, who are the owners of Otour, really appreciate basically the, the coming together of masculine and feminine. It's, there's, a, there's a certain depth and character that comes from fruit, Pinot Noir fruit, but there's a beauty that I think that's extremely important in Pinot Noir. So what we search for is great acidity and elegance in Pinot. And it's basically the way we do that is working with older vineyards, very small yields in the vineyard, and picking what we consider to be, or other people might consider a little bit on the earlier side, because we want to retain the elegance of Pinot Noir, what we feel it's all about. Okay. So your wines tend to be a little, uh, little more, a little less sweet, because They're, they have less hang time. Exactly. They, they, uh, they don't have to have dominant fruit characteristics. They're more on the restrained side. Um, some years they require aging. They often require decanting. They're wines that pair with food. And they're, frankly, they're wines that actually we feel require a certain amount of thought. They're, they're not just throwback wines. They, they're, very, to us, very serious. And what kind of foods would really um, be enhanced by your Pinot? I mean, traditional. I mean, you can go um, definitely mushroom styles. Some of our Pinots can work with uh, fish, uh, but definitely things like rabbit, uh, you know, anything truffle, anything on the earthy side is what I think is best with our wines. So Kenneth, I can't help but admire your beautiful um, label here. Thank you. It's very, very elegant, very simple. Can you tell us how you came about getting this together? Sure, um, my wife and I, it took us about six years to finally come up with a name. Um, but the reason we came up with Autour is it, it's French and it, it translates to author or composer and being that my wife is also an English major from Wisconsin, um, we also feel that it really kind of tells the story of the vintage. And, and to us, to us, wine really is not just about the wine itself. It's about everything that goes into it. I mean, it's about the personalities that grow the fruit, the guys that actually work in the vineyard, uh, the weather that happens throughout the growing season, everything. And there's, there's a story in, in every bottle. And it's definitely cliche, but we believe in it. And um, would you be willing to give us your, your website information where yeah, people sure. could it's, purchase uh, it? It's uh, autourwines.com. So A-U-T-E-U-R wines.com. That's great. Thank you very much. My pleasure. Thank you.